Welcome to our webinar implemented within the Creative Digital Transformation EU funded project focusing on the creative planning process. I'm Gabriela Antezza, Training Manager of Matera Hub, and in this webinar I will introduce you to the Creative Project Canvas, a reflection entrepreneurial tool implemented by Matera Hub that will help you explore, visualize, and develop a creative project or idea. As Benjamin Franklin stated, if you fail to plan, you plan to fail. That is so true, as planning is the key process to steer and manage one's personal, social and professional life. So, making an idea into a living and successful project requires abilities to set clear goals, to plan what you want to achieve, how, when and with, for whom, because a goal without a plan is just a wish. At this stage, when it is crucial to visualize and reflect upon one's own project idea, the Creative Project Canvas can be a key tool to detail different aspects of the project creatively, reflecting on its sustainability and on its impacts in a short, medium and long term. The Creative Project Canvas can be used as an individual reflection tool and or as a team reflection tool to elaborate, clarify, evaluate and reflect upon a project or to kickstart and initiate a project to monitor and chart your progress. The Creative Project Canvas will assist you in mapping, developing and planning different ideas, thinking about the different aspects of the project, finding out how to connect with people wishing to see, engage or participate in the project, connecting the big picture with the final details of each of the potential stages of the project, calculating the potential impact of the project from different perspectives, and mix what you usually do with some fresh ideas and approaches. Let's explore the purposes, features and practical use of the Creative Project Canvas. Since the themes are mutually connected to each other, we suggest following specific steps to reflect and implement the creative process that will lead you to build your own creative project canvas. So start from the value theme, which is the core of your project, and then move to the left three themes, which are belonging to networks, activities and work, equipment, materials and time. Then move to the right three themes, which are champions, access for others, getting feedback. Finally, move to the two bottom themes, reflecting the immediate and future plans of your project, which are short-term gains and losses, long-term rewards. Since the themes are mutually connected to each other, we suggest following specific steps to reflect and implement the creative process that will lead you to build your own creative project canvas. So start from the value theme, which is the core of your project, and then move to the left three themes, which are belonging to networks, activities and work, equipment, materials and time. Then move to the right three themes, which are champions, access for others, getting feedback. Finally, move to the two bottom themes, reflecting the immediate and future plans of your project, which are short-term gains and losses, long-term rewards. By answering all the key questions listed in each theme, you will build your Creative Project Canvas and visualize a brief, however clear and straightforward, plan of your project or idea. The value theme will help you explore the value of your project to yourself and others and how you can obtain the benefit of providing that value. So you will ask yourself, what are the main reasons why you engage with the project? Why will others engage with it and choose your work and not the, the work of others? What does it give them? Does it satisfy need or desire or solve a problem? How? How do you receive the benefit of delivering this value to yourself and to others? The Belonging to Network theme will help you explore the useful networks you currently belong to or you might join as a source of contacts and resources to create, develop, produce and promote your project. So you will ask yourself, 
Can you or how can you develop consolidate contacts by letting people know about you and your work? Are there partners and members of your network who can help you make this project happen? What will they bring to the project? The activities and work theme will help you reflect on the main activities and workflow of your project, such as research, preparation, production, marketing, touring, workshops, reviewing, and so on. So you will ask yourself, what are the most important activities needed to make this project happen? Who will carry them out? Will you need to develop new skills or capabilities for, the, for this project? Or will you think of other organizations, professionals, who might do them? The equipment, material, and time theme will help you identify the equipment that you need, the materials you use. It can be recycled, reused from previous projects, and the time for each progress, giving the whole time requirement. So you need to think about it is some sometimes easier to get the resources you need from different sources rather than raise the money to pay for this. Remember that time is money and you have to calculate its economic value to generate short and medium term, term profits. Think carefully about the resources that you will need for your project, including equipment, space, people, national, virtual and physical suppliers, technology, intellectual property and others. The Champions theme will help you develop and strengthen your own entrepreneurial voice by identifying who can serve you as a guide and champion or as a critic to improve aspects of your work. They might be friends, relatives, mentors, coaches, colleagues, and so on. So you will need to ask yourself, who appreciates your talent, believe in your potential, and advocate your work to others? Who can be your cheerleaders? Who can support and recommend you and your work to others throughout your career? Who critically reviews your work and highlights areas that they consider positive and negative. The access for others theme will help you analyze how others can access your work. So think about what are the different ways and places through which others can access work. For example, online, in public places, through publications, broadcast, pop-up shops, and so on. The Getting Feedback theme will help you explore current and potential tools and methods to get feedback about your work or project from everyone who comes or might come into contact with it, including existing and or potential client, customers, audience, audience, and so on. So the questions to ask yourself are, who can give you feedback? How can they do that? How can you collect feedback, for example, through informal conversations, telephones, online service, focus groups, use of emoticons, etc.? What kind of approach can you have to collect feedback? For example, a personal approach, neutral, informal, formal, individual, group, and so on. The short-term gains and losses theme is about the value of your project to you in the short term and what this project might give you in terms of rewards and losses. Short-term gains include the feeling of happiness for doing what you aspire to do, such as making new contacts and develop new networks, making new professional experiences, building professional trust and credibility, Short-term losses include, for example, not getting enough money for what you are doing so that you personally have to cover the actual costs or having less free time for your professional life. The long-term rewards theme is about more frequent or greater opportunities, larger networks and increased remuneration to invest in future creative works or to increase the reach uh, or impact of the work. Long-term rewards are related to one's own definition of success that may include sustainability, further development, more opportunities for future projects. Now it's time to take action and pitch your project. 
Now that your Creative Project Canvas is ready, it is time to present your idea to your audience. Here are the five golden rules to pitch your project. First of all, keep it simple and short. Your pitch should last no more than 15 minutes. Use simple, effective language. Condense your creative project into a presentation of no more than 10 to 15 slides. Secondly, know who you are pitching to. Think about what you want. Be assertive and show your audience that you know what you're looking for and exactly what you want from them, highlighting that they can benefit from your project too as a win-to-win -win relationship. Thirdly, address the problem. Point out the current problem. Bring it in one simple sentence clearly and then present your solution. Keep in mind your audience and the research you have done on the competitors and other organizations running similar projects. Fourthly, why is your approach unique? So highlight the uniqueness of your project, service and product, because your audience will pay a lot of attention to distinctive and innovative aspects. Finally, inspire others by telling your story and creating empathy throughout your presentation. Choose the keywords of your project. Describe it with a short and effective sentence to let your audience know the key goals and aspects of your project. So choose the title of your project and an effective slogan that can easily highlight the key aspects and benefits of your project for any users and clients. Create a short and effective text that may be used as a post on Facebook or a presentation of your website. Choose or create an image for your project to make it more understandable. Put yourself in your audience's shoes in order to communicate your ideal project effectively. If you customize your language, contents, and communicative approach based on the different audiences you choose to address, the presentation and understanding of your project will be more effective and clear. Now, we suggest you reviewing your Creative Project Canvas over and over again to improve your answers until the whole project seems harmonious and well-structured. Remember to discuss, share, and collect valuable suggestions from your supporters and all professional users or customers. Now enjoy your entrepreneurial journey through the Creative Project Canvas.